Welcome back to Newslink. Now, Woolies looter Mbuso Muloi is expected back in the Durban Magistrates Court today. And during his first court appearance, Muloi pleaded guilty to charges of theft after he was caught on video during the 2021 July unrest, allegedly looting a basket of goods from a Woolworths food store out in KwaZulu Natal. Now, Muloi might become the first person to possibly be found guilty in the events of the July riots, but ENC reporter Leti Wimbluli joins me now. Uh, to, of course, uh, give more on the story. Leti, good morning to you, colleague. Uh, what's the latest that you can tell us about this case? We understand that uh, Mbuso Mloy will be back in court. Well, Dumelo, today we are expecting for pre-sentencing to take place. Um, the last time when we were here in April, um, Buso Moloi made a brief court appearance and uh, the magistrate did um, say that to t today um, they're expecting to give him a sentence. And as you correctly said, um, Buso Moloi might actually be the first person to actually face the law when it comes to the looting that took place in July 2021 here in Durban. You'd remember that a lot of stores and businesses were vandalized and as a result there were some people um, that were um, arrested and in the case of Mloy though um, he handed himself over to the police after his video went viral on social media showing him carrying that basket of food um, and quickly rushing into his Mercedes-Benz um, back in 2021. Following those events a lot of people were seeing the video and he then handed himself over to the police because it was trending on social media and after he handed himself over. He was then charged with numerous crimes, but we do understand that today um, or when the last time he actually appeared, he uh, pleaded guilty to, two, to two, two charges rather, which is theft and contravention of the National Road Traffic Regulation. And today we will be hearing whether he will be sentenced for his crimes um, that he's pleaded guilty to. And during the last time he appeared in court, his lawyer, Willie Lombard, actually read out um, some of the the things that um, Muloy had wanted um, to, for the court to hear, um, including the fact that he said um, him taking that basket of food from the Woolworths store was an act of, um, he didn't think about it. Um, it was just a spare of a moment thing. He saw, um, spare of a moment thing rather, and he saw people um, taking food from the store, so he just also um, did it, and he apologized for doing so. So today, of course, we will be hearing Dumelo whether um, he will be receiving um, maybe years in jail, or maybe he will be receiving, um, uh, uh, he will need to pay a fine for some of the things that he's pled guilty to. We also are expecting to speak to him after the court because he has indicated that he wants to have his say. Um, he says he wants to talk about how he was treated when he handed himself over to the police um, back in 2021. He says he did not receive um, a good caring when he was um, in jail at that time. So we will um, speak to him if he's available and we'll hear his side of the story as to why he did what he did back in July 2021 when there was looting in Osorona town. Yeah, well, of course, uh, looking forward to the conversation. Hopefully we can uh, hear from uh, Mbuso uh, Muloi in this regard. We've only heard uh, of him and where he stands through his lawyers in court. And this would be, of course, the first time that we get to uh, hear from him from the horse's mouth as to what exactly happened, uh, especially if he still wants to also narrate uh, the treatment that he claims to have received uh, since uh, handing himself over. So, Letio, we'll leave it at that. Uh, a colleague as Mbuso Muloi, of course, is expected uh, to hear his sentencing today. He he has pleaded guilty, though, uh, to, of course, theft this after he was caught on video holding that Woolworths a basket coming from the store, heading over to his Mercedes-Benz uh, with those uh, goods this July, uh, during rather the July 2021 rides. We'll be sure to catch up with you as soon as there are other updates on the story.